How do you feel about fireworks? I don't mind them. Like, they are a bit weird when you think about them, right? It's kind of like there's these these things that we buy, that we spend money on and then burn in a very dramatic fashion. I mean, you could say the same thing about... Uh, but sounds the dramatic fashion, you could say the same thing about gas. <laughs> yeah, that's true. <laughs> For no reason, though. Usually gas has a purpose, right? Which is either to heat us or cook food, mm. um, or, or heat water. But this one is right. to look pretty. Um, it doesn't last for very long, but it's kind of cool. Tell you what though, you can really tell the difference between cheap fireworks and expensive fireworks. Oh, because yeah. cheap ones always just fart from the, you know, the ground position, and expensive ones are the ones that actually go up in, into the air and go boom. And if it's a cheap one and it goes into the air, it goes ping. You know what I mean? <laughs> know what I mean? <laughs> Not, not really, no, but I'll take your word for it, man. Thanks, I assume man, you thanks. sort by highest price when you're looking for fireworks <laughs> as well, so... <laughs> yeah, the one one year I made a mistake and accidentally did buy the highest price ones when I forgot to revert back to low. Fireworks can be expensive as well, man. I know, God, they really can come. It can be like hundreds of pounds. You like yeah. it, and it literally... Caught, it's like a mini display. It's absolutely mad. Also severely annoying to everyone else, probably. Oh, almost certainly. Yeah, like I get them and I'm fine with them until people start setting them off at all times, right? Like past 11.30. Past your bedtime. Past my bedtime. That Actually, that would be past 8 p.m. then, Isaac. That would be, <laughs> can't, be, can't be the day past my bedtime. <laughs> what do you think about the way in which people tend to kind of stretch holidays to be week long? People like like the way Christmas has become like a, a season, right? More than a holiday. Or people mm. have you'll, you'll find people who are like, it's my birthday week, so I'm going to be doing things oh, all week. God, yeah, they, people do do that, don't they? <laughs> and alternatively, people will be like, it's bonfire night week, so we can set fireworks off any time this yeah. week. Yeah, or you know, instead of Amazon Prime Day, it's Amazon Prime Week. <laughs> <laughs> Amazon are doing early Black Friday deals as of like I Halloween. Saw that. <laughs> I, w- I saw that and I was like, it, it's literally it's an month exact away. month before it starts. <laughs> I'm like, at this point, they're going to become like the freaking DFS sale. Like, every day is a sale. Yeah. Yeah. They're just deals. They're not Black Friday deals. You don't have to. It's absolutely uh, wild. Early Black Friday deals. <laughs> it's amazing. Yeah, literally. It's just deals. They're just. It's just deals. I can't believe it. Honestly. January 1st rolls around, early Black Friday deals, everybody. Let's yeah. go. <laughs> 20, 29th. When, when is Black Friday? Is it 27th of November or 29th? It's the the day after the fourth Thursday in November. So usually, oh, okay, it's not set then. Because Thanksgiving in the US, I believe, is on the fourth Thursday in November. So that's how that, uh, and it's the I Friday see. after Thanksgiving. Oh, I see. I see. Okay. Interesting. I've got these sky blocks, Isaac, which I think I can place down and it'll, you know, rip a hole in the dimension. Yes, uh, we can do that. You do need to give it a redstone signal, but you can, so, well, do you have one? Uh, yeah. So you can either do this and it rips a hole in the in the dimension of, of reality, um, or you can just craft them with the lever, I believe. Or you craft them with a redstone torch. Oh, right. Oh, I see. I see. I see. To make them reverse... Yeah, to make them like always active. Yeah, so you've got half a second, I've got half a sec. So we have a stack of these, and you can put them down like this, and they're permanently um, inverted. Permanently hole ripping. These are great. Um, I've been using them, I've used them for a while, but I've been using them most recently in my antimatter chemistry series, Nick. Mm. I use them as like a roof for an underground dungeon so that it doesn't look like it's the roof, it looks like it's the sky. Oh, uh, that's, quite, that's quite handy, actually. Yeah. It's neat. However, these shred through GPU usage. They are not like oh, well optimized. Really? Yeah. Weird. I put down like a full roof of them. Whenever I look at my roof, my frame rate tanks below 60 and my GPU usage goes up to 100%. Oh my God. I wonder what that is. I think it's just the way that they're they're like, like loaded rendered. and rendered and stuff yeah. like that. Yeah, God, yeah. One's fine, but if you start putting down like a hundred of them or using them in like mass quantities, they can really start to, to tank your performance. Yeah, it's like Christmas lights, right? One set's fine, but that one family that decides to, you know, sap the national grids, that's where it really <laughs> hurts performance. <laughs> oh, the, oh, the energy bill on that bad boy. Oof. 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 Do you have an air charm by any chance? 
I do. I also have one. I just wanted to get this. Uh, yeah, I want to get this crucible down. Oh, no, there's already you double layered this platform. And what in the why is that? Oh, you've just misplaced a bunch of cobblestone. Oh, yeah, this is the <laughs> these are the <laughs> well, my odds were not high to get to, to pick one, though. I managed to break the exact block or one of the exact blocks that had cobblestone underneath it. Oh, yeah. Well, here's the thing, right? Isaac, yeah, yeah, you actually you smashed it there. Um, well, I was placing it like this, right, from a side angle, so I have no idea how they got placed underneath the block because I wasn't flying and was below the the platform, right, to be able to face the top of the block. Okay, are you ready to have your mind shattered? Oh, Nick? go on, here we go. I believe this is a quark feature. Oh, yes. So take a block. Here you go. Take some. Take some gravel. It's a quirk of quark, is it, Isaac? It's a quirk. It's a quarky quirk. Yeah. Got it. If you look at the block, so come out, come out here. Shift on the edge. Look down the block. If you get right close to the bottom, you'll see a little bracket appear around your corsair. Like go right underneath the block, and then you can place underneath. Oh yeah, you know I saw that for a second. So it's obviously not useful for this or for what we were doing, but for building underneath where you don't have these air charms yeah you can build underneath with that it's a little quark feature that like you build right. under a block interesting okay well there you go you learn something new every day what else is in quark isaac there's a load of physics knowledge it's a ton of it adds a ton of stuff quarks are mod by, by vasque and uh ah. it just adds like a bunch of quality of life like vanilla features it doesn't add anything like crazy game breaking I see. but it adds like a lot of small stuff like that right that uh that improve the the base game got it got it interesting um i've got a it i've got a i've got this isaac look at this look at this boy it's a freaking cotton candy sheet it looks like a pinata man Do you reckon there's all inside of it <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, Isaac, there was raw mutton. Hey, hey. Did a sorted for nice. <laughs> uh, uh, I love pinatas with meat inside them. <laughs> oh gosh, no, please, <laughs> no. Uh, could you imagine going to, a, going to a party and that's what they had up? Oh no, <laughs> oh no, don't know what are you doing? That's the, don't hit it with the baseball bat. <laughs> Go get dinner, kids. They had like a cow up, like an egg for burgers later. Hit the oh, pinata. No. We're not going to have dinner tonight. Jeez. That's horrible. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry <laughs> to all vegans. I'm sorry to all people. And just like, everyone that's... else. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's oh, horrendous, man. man. That's, um... Oh, look at this. I got a, uh, a magma block here. Yeah, I got a couple of them earlier as well. Can be useful. They have a, uh, a 10x speed modifier on the Crucible. Oh, that is good. Up from 5x on the lava, so they're twice as fast. And I get to keep the lava. And no fire hazard either, Isaac. Yeah, God, you win in every regard. I like that. I believe I now have everything for this cobblestone generator. I totally do. Nice. Okay, so so cobblestone is ready to go. So I can, I can save my bare fist going forward. Mm. I will also now make a storage drawer for this cobblestone. Very nice. You can also hook that, Isaac, to the autosave. Yeah, we could do it. I'd have to put it underneath. Oh, I see. The autosave is very self-contained, though, because of its uh, the spectre coil. So feel free to, like, chop and change and move it around and stuff. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Get a lovely sunset. Not to be that guy. And I say that, but I always am that guy. About the, 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 the choice of materials utilized mm. in the base right now nick there's a lot of material like there's a lot happening there's a lot happening man there's a lot happening how do you currently feel about what's happening i mean i'm looking i'm seeing textures i'm seeing flavors i'm seeing you know colors everything i want in a plate of food isaac you know <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> <laughs> I think we have very different um, meal desires, oh, Nick. You know, I'm, I'm I a know what he's going to say. He's going <laughs> to say he wants it all to be one block. I'm a fan preferably. of a very muted, a muted meal. Like a very, God, yeah. A very, very, a very very simple. Baked beans on toast. Or just, you know what? Isaac would just say no toast, just beans. And you know what? While you're at it, no beans, just the sauce. Wow. Yeah, one, just, just one just, thing. Just toast, untoasted, please. <laughs> just bread. <laughs> With the crust cut off. We can't have too many <laughs> textures, all right? 
I mean, if you want to, you know, homogenize the amount of materials we're using, Isaac, we can do that. We can do that. But I feel uh, do like you we have can... the sorry, real quick. Do you have the iron that was in this furnace? Oh yes, there you go. There you go. Thank you. Go on. You were talking about uh, homogenification. We can, we can. You know how we're building down. The down bit can be more plain, right? Get a mix of it. You know what I mean? So that sure. you get the right level of 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 lots and little. Yeah, I mean the top could also be more plain, right? Like we could do like we could we could instead have like all plain. Oh my goodness me, this guy. Freaking also, out. Nick, Nick, look at this. What's up? There's a mod called Ultimate Skyblock Resource Generator. And I've just made a freaking clear generator, man. What, it just does it? I think so. Hold on, let me, let me, I'm, I'm not, I'm not familiar with the mod, but if I put like, okay, like I was hopeful it would just like, most like the cobblestone generator, just pump. It would just spew uh, it. Pump it out. Uh, it might need to go like on top. It might just be the other yeah. way around. It also might need a lever. It also might not work how I think it's going to work. Surely it must. Hold on. There's a quest for you. Let's have a look. It says, uh, that's a mouthful. Let's just call it Usug. Usug. Usug lets you generate, uh, let's create <laughs> generators for many different resources. You need to pipe out of them somehow. Conduits are similar. Simple but effective. Ah, so we need like a, um, say, yeah, a hopper or something. Yeah, you out of it or something. Yeah. Right. I wonder what the rate of uh, production. production is. Yeah. Let's have a look. So does that work? That totally works. Look at that. It does, yeah. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. If you shift, you can see at the top there. Oh, oh right. Yeah, no, I, I do see it. I was wondering if it was going to go to 20, but no, it's going to go to 100, isn't it? It's going to go to uh, 2048. Oh, my goodness me. Storage draws ailed a lot, man. Oh, it's going to go to like one oh, time no, no, no. 64 to the power of... I mean the, the climbing number, Isaac. The, yeah, that's uh... the amount of clear that's there. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah, it's that's fast. what I'm saying. Like, sit, like, like a stack of clay. We got one oh, stack of fifteen clay. Goodness, yeah. No, no, I'm no. I'm thinking no, no. that was the, like a countdown timer to no. the next block. Yeah. <laughs> so do you know what? I'm used to seeing a nice, cute number on the front, but uh, right. of the actual storage drawer itself. Yeah, that's fast. How hard was that to make this uh, this clay generator? It was one bucket of lava, one bucket of water, of which we had the buckets back. So one lava, one water, and then a clay and six shovels. Oh, so you check not the quest hard. book. No, if you check the quest book, there's a in that second quest line. There's like a whole the bottom left of the chapter is dedicated to all oh, these. Oh, right, yeah, look at that. Old, yeah, ultimate sky block resource generator. Yeah, dirt, cobble. Obviously, we've got cobble, so that's not as as required. Yeah, yeah look at that. There's a bunch of them. It's so like snow, endstone, netherite, quartz, soul sand, clay, redstone, glowstone, ice, like redstone. The redstone one, the redstone one's a bucket of lava, a bucket of water, a piece of redstone, and then six diamond pickaxes. That's very doable. And do we, you know, like the redstone generator and, you know, the food generator. Oh. And you know, yeah, I'm thinking, can we just make one of those and then plop this on top? Free power. I think we totally could, man. Yeah. Holy crap. And like a redstone generator is probably quite good. I think there's a, there's a heated redstone generator, which uses lava and redstone. I don't think there's just a redstone generator. But they're quite they're quite good, aren't they? Those heated redstone generators. I believe so. Yeah, we could combine like we do have lava being made, right, with the cobblestone generator. Cobblestone generator plus crucible equals infinite lava. Mm. Infinite lava plus infinite redstone equals heated redstone generator. Man. Yeah, we can you know scale that as well. Well, I like it. I like yeah. it. Yeah, I good also stuff. like it. Interesting. Nice. Who knew, man? Who knew? All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna get a redstone generator, man. Heated redstone generator requires a load of redstone and a magmatic generator, which is some gold lava, redstone, and a furnace generator. It's quite all right, actually. Should I, I, I might make this. That, yeah, make go this. for it, man. I want to make this. I yeah. don't know if we have much of a need for power at the moment, but we're going we're to need power eventually, right? So, exactly. Look at this. Might it well. generates a block of redstone at a time. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. <laughs> this mod is overpowered. I love it. <laughs> oh, great. boy. And I had 36, 45, 54, 63, 72. You know, that's the rate of which it's generating redstone. It's absolutely yeah, that's, a, that's a rate that we can get behind, man. I love it. I love it. That's, okay. a, that's a, good, uh, a good ROI, man. That is a good ROI. Yeah, it's like investing in a in a index fund and getting a 65% uh, ROI year on year, man. It's yeah, a freaking exactly. Market. Jeez. Hitting those targets. Yeah. You're a big fan of, uh, of ROIs, Nick? Yeah, man. I love a good ROI. Especially the Republic of Ireland, Isaac. That's my favourite <laughs> Ireland. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe that's why Ireland, you know, everyone's always talking about Ireland and tax and whatnot, right? Maybe that's I'm why. I've just invested the country. That's all. 
us. Just like holistically. A bunch, <laughs> a bunch of like novice investors heard the term ROI, the ROI and, and then just they, pumped money they, into they Ireland. Accidentally gave the government some money. <laughs> <laughs> Never saw it again. <laughs> uh, uh, everyone thinks Ireland's like uh, a place for low tax. It's actually just where everyone's sending their money. <laughs> the reason there's low tax is because everyone's accidentally putting money into it. <laughs> thinking uh, that they're going to get returns. Uh, uh. Okay. Um, do you have that iron stash, Isaac, or is it? Uh... I have forty-seven. Oh yeah. Iron. Can I tap you into go. that, please? I'll let you oh, tap that you. any day of the week. Oh man. yeah. Let me tap that iron. Here we go. Right. Yeah. There's quite a lot of iron required for this bad boy, but it'll be fine because it will power the hopefully auto machines, Isaac. The auto resource machines. So that's what Nick. We have we want. bonsai pots. Oh yeah, we do. I'm gonna make some bonsai pots real quick. So I'm, I was just thinking like. You know, we've got wood now, but like if I want more wood going forward, which everybody, you know, everyone wants more wood when they can get it. Exactly. Like I'm going to, I'm going to get that, uh, get that going, man. Do it, man. Do it. Yeah. Because you don't want to have the need for wood and then find out that there isn't any and then wait for, you know, it to grow. Exactly. So you want it to be there on demand, Isaac. So, Bingo. you know. No one ever wants to wait for wood to grow. You want it to be ready as and when you demand it to be ready. Exactly. God, I'm so glad we're on the same page. Exactly Bizarre. the same page. Bizarre. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Okay, here we go. I have my uh, my bricks. Uh, I do need some wood, though. I need some gold, Isaac. Oh, I have some wood for you, if you like, Isaac. You see, if you don't, if you don't have the generator, just ask me. I've always got wood. There you go. Okay, thanks, man. Um, what block does gold get harvested from? Is it sand, gravel, or clay? I think it might be sand. We have a mod installed, Nick, that shows you recipes. I knew you were going to say that, but that <laughs> requires typing an effort. And you probably, you just know. Oh, man, you're right. one of these people who, like, freaking, whenever you want to search something, you open up Google Assistant instead of actually just typing it into Google. Like, <laughs> No, I don't, Isaac. I, <laughs> no, I, no, I, no, I, I no, on, no. I'm feeling lucky, all right, and hope. <laughs> That's what I actually do. Oh. Get it right. God, I can't be using my keyboard. I have to just say... <laughs> I just ask Google my question. Jeez, this guy. I oh, know, always, always. Is anyone is anyone using the "I'm feeling lucky" feature? Like, what's the what's the deal with that? Oh God, I don't know. I swear, I feel like it's just there, you know, to please the to please, you know, the, the gambling corporations that they are <laughs> tied to. I'm yeah, like... exactly, exactly. Right, exactly. So just to feed into you know tr tradition. Basically, because it's always been there. You can't remove it. Sure. You can't get I mean, rid you of it. You could remove it, though. Like, there's well, always, hold on. Hold there's on, always hold someone going to be using it. Hold on. What's up? Google.com. What the heck happens when you hit it? I actually don't even know. So, right. It just takes you to a random result, I think. Does it? I'm pretty sure it does. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Okay. So, a Google, it took me to a googleaday.com. So apparently that's like a like a Google, like a daily puzzle thing. Let me try again. I'm feeling playful. Pac-Man. It took me to the Pac-Man Google result. I'm feeling artistic. It took me to artsandculture.google.com slash partner. Right. And then I'm looking at a gallery. I'm feeling trendy. It took me to the Google Trends page. It feels like it's uh it feels like they have cherry picked uh, a, a few, you know, it feels like there's one one. Company it doesn't actually in take you to a random website. Yeah. It takes you to a random curated Google website. It, it, it takes you to a pre-existing Google page. Right, I see. And I, for, you know, Nick, uh, my day is ruined. Yeah. Fair enough, man. I feel like that's because um, back in the day, someone probably let it take them to a random page, right? And it was something, you know, horrible, horrible. and evil. Yeah, yeah. Probably. And then like it was like a way to like, bypass like network security as well. And yeah, like... exactly. <laughs> and they were like, yeah, oh, Google did it. It's all Google's yeah, it's fault. Not, it's not our fault. <laughs> it wasn't me. <laughs> Google. <laughs> Google, obviously. That'll be what it is. Yeah, that sounds about right, man. Yeah. Uh, man. I'm working on uh, some tinkers as well here. Oh, nice, nice. Here we go. Right, so it is gravel in a diamond stiffened mesh is fine with a 40% drop chance. Oh, well, I didn't get any. God's sakes. Okay, that's fine. Got some gravel in here, luckily, from my freaking auto hammer. Yeah, coming in handy. You using the uh, the right the right materials, yeah? I believe so. Broken gold, 
that comes from you've got to check the the sieve right i guess the check the heavy used. sieve shouldn't i yeah so you don't get any gold with a string mesh Oh, right. From gravel. I thought there was a diamond stiffened mesh in here. Yeah, no, okay. See, no, that's... there was a diamond stiffened mesh here, but I took it out because you don't get bone meal from a diamond uh, stiffened mesh. Yeah. yeah that's, got where, mix. that's where it's happened. That's where it's mm. happened. That's where Bingo. It's happened. Bingo. All right, let me let me grab the diamond boy. Here we go. I guess really we should look at getting these gravel. Like the gravel generator is just... Uh, well, so you can, there's a cobblestone generator that we don't need because we have one. Mm -hmm. The gravel generator just needs gold pickaxes. So once you have the gold back, we could use that. Uh, the sand generator just needs shovels and sand. There's a dirt generator, a grass generator. That could be useful. Like, I could really, I like grass. Mm, tell me all. Tell me all. I, I could, I could, I could get behind abolishing the abomination that you've abundantly abound a, a, among us. And, you know. Hey, well done. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's mean, beautiful wood of which there's a variety this, this, of textures. This horrific mismatch of, of concentric <laughs> patterns that don't align and that just <laughs> it actually looks it looks quite funny if you go like a if you jump up, it looks like Aladdin's carpet or something like yeah, that. Yeah, doesn't I mean, fly. So, so maybe just just just, 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 spit, just spitballing an idea, Nick. But maybe we could get rid of it and, and instead I mean, put down right. some grass. <laughs> you want to change it? You change it. <laughs> and then uh, you know, once we have grass, then we can you know it'll be nice. Uh, mycelium, obsidian, ice, snow, endstone, netherrack, quartz. If we can get one nether quartz, we can make the quartz generator and get infinite nether quartz. So we only need one from one bag. Uh, clay, redstone, glowstone, and and dust. So sand, gravel, and dust seem like they should be high level lists of things to to generate because mm. then we can then we can and i mean i'm not gonna lie Nick, it does kind of just kind of somewhat null void the uh the auto hammer that you've uh you've made i mean uh i mean uh i'm not gonna don't, you know i don't want to be i don't want to be that, that oh guy. wait hold on why 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 sand gravel and dust yeah if we make a sand gravel and dust generator we don't need this oh right like this this thing that, yeah, you've, that you've wasted <laughs> our resources this, on this poor <laughs> auto hammer uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna put it in I wanna keep it on a pedestal just to remember it, Isaac, you know? It's like a museum. What we could have used. Yeah, that sounds that's probably gonna be a lot more efficient, isn't it? For sure, for sure. But Nick, that's gonna have to wait for the next stream, man. Because uh, It is, it is. Yeah, that's probably where we're gonna wrap up the uh, Sky of Diamonds segment for today. We've got some we got a lot of stuff here, man. We got some yeah. generators going, we got lava, we got clay. Um, I've begun smelting seared bricks, so I can hopefully get a smeltery going next time. Uh, we can get some tinkers. Uh, tools. We also have Tinker's Armory installed, which lets us make mm. pretty powerful like Tinker's Armory. <laughs>